guys welcome back to my channel thank you for taking the time every day to stop by. okay guys i have a dollar tree haul for you guys <laughs> if you're new to my channel hi my name is pam welcome to pam's life where you hear the kitty cat behind me meowing okay so i have a dollar tree haul for you i did a fall haul because i wanted to start uh, decorating for fall um, so a lot of this stuff has to do with fall so I'll show you I get I get these from my car to put down like on my on my uh, back seat because you know you guys know we have the pops so this is the one that I got here this rug it says hi there pumpkin and it has these really cute pumpkins so I put them along the back of my seat so when the dogs jump into the car that if they're muddy or whatever, I can just change them for a dollar twenty-five. So I apologize, she's gonna be mooing a lot. All right, so I went online and I saw I'll show you. I went online and I saw a bunch of really pretty flowers, all new flowers that they had for the fall. So I did want to get in and get some because I am changing out um, this here, right here. I'm changing that out to make it fall instead of spring. I'm going to do fall. And these are the ones that I chose. I try not to choose too many because I'm still going to leave some of the greenery around it and then I have some lights that go in there so and I'm going to put a candle in the middle and build around it so the first things I got was I I only got one of each because I didn't want to go too crazy with the flowers because I have a tendency to do that these are just called flocking balls very pretty uh, let me see hold on one second guys Sorry, I, I, I want to put them in a bag. And my hair, I don't have my hair up for a change. It's actually, see how long and straight it is? I need a cut. I really need a cut. All right, and I did get two of these though. And they're metallic mini mims. Mini, mini mims. Mini mums. So I did get two of these because one, I thought they were really, really pretty. Very pretty. And I love the color. It just screams fall. So I got two of them. This one is a filler fern, so it has these pretty little flowers. You can see them, very, very pretty. And I'll hold these up again. These are the mini mums, but they say metallic, I guess, because you can't see it on here, but if you can see, it has like metallic tips to it. This one is just the wheat, and it has these like little grass here. And we, I should have really got two of those, but I only got one. Um, this one again says mini mums, but it's like this little, I got this for a single, just for a single vase, like a small single vase, but I really like that. Very, very pretty. And then this one is wildflowers. So it's just wildflowers. I can see, that's what it says. There you go. So that is just for like, just just to do a floral um, design with, nothing, nothing major. But then I also got this. So I was thinking maybe if I don't do the candle, I can do the little scarecrow and build around this scarecrow. That's why I got the one with the orange hat. Um, I thought it was really cute. You know, this is so cute. It has a little apron on <laughs> with a little jeans. So cute. So I was thinking maybe I could build my floral arrangement around that. Oh, I found this. Isn't this cute? This is dishwasher safe. It's a little spatula and it says um, Gnome Sweet Gnome. Mm -hmm. And it's by Cooking Concepts. Very, very cute. And they, they had another one that had a home sweet home, but I, I love this one. So I got that. This I got because I want to make something for my door for the fall. And it says, hello, autumn. I just thought that was really, really cute with the little beads at the top. I thought that was so cute. So I, I do want to make something with this. I'm not quite sure what yet. And I did get the box. These look like little books. Um, so it says, thank, uh, thankful, grateful, and blessed. I thought that was really cute. So I might 
It does look like it's a little box though. I might tie a, some jute around it, put some little beads on it and just make it like a little book stack. Cause I don't, I don't really have a lot of room. I got this cooking concepts, uh, garlic press. Now Stefano, he doesn't know his own strength and he likes to like break things on me. So <laughs> I don't think he'll be able to use this one um, because I, th I don't know, I'm gonna test it out and use it and see how well it works. Then I got two more of the pumpkins. Now this upsets me. I just noticed that this one is ripped. See how it's ripped? I'm gonna have to sew that. But this one says thankful. Very, very cute. But it is ripped right there. So some of the stuffing is coming out. I have to fix that. And then this one is a felt one. Very, very cute. I love I love this new decor that they have. So cute. Um, I did get this pumpkin little tray here. It has a pumpkin on it. It's a little tray. So I think that's really cute. I don't know where to put that. So I'm going to put that away right now. I'm going to put it right here. I don't want it getting broken. I did get a silver acorn. Now I got these before. So, but I do think that they are so pretty. Very, very pretty. And I got these stacked pumpkins that say blessed. I got them last year. I never even put them out. So I'll be using them this year. I picked up two of this. This is like a gold color and this is like a rust color. I'm gonna make some tassels for when I do my swag for my mantle. When I do my swag for my mantle, it'll look really, really cute. You'll see it. I will show it to you guys. Got another pumpkin. I, I, now I think I have all the colors. I don't think I had, oh, I did have the green before. So I think I do have all the colors now of the little pumpkin picks. These are just so cute. Are they not the cutest? So I think they are so cute. So got them. And I love these flower sack towels. These are the towels that I use in my kitchen all the time. I love them for cleaning also. So they are really great. I love them. You can bleach them clean. They are so nice. I use them for everything actually. So I got those. And then I got a pumpkin. This one, I don't remember putting a pumpkin in, in there. I don't know how I got a pumpkin. But this one has, um, if you can see, it has a leaf design on it. So I don't remember putting this in there. I don't know because <laughs> I wouldn't have picked it up. I have enough pumpkins like that. And then Stefano saw this because he was with me. He saw this little silicone thing. So I don't know what he wants to make out of it, but he probably wants to make something. Sometimes I, I make shaped butters and stuff and I mold butter like garlic butter, herb butter, and I pour them in here and then I poke them out. So that's not too bad for $1.25. And then I'm trying gonna try this. This is the PS Clean Beauty Leave-In Conditioner, sulfate-free, paraben-free, dye-free. Um, cruelty free and vegan it's 10 um fluid ounces um so i i hope that it i don't know we'll see they had a whole entire line but i didn't of course buy any because i actually got kind of expensive shampoo which for myself i usually do not use expensive stuff but i wanted to just keep myself to one type of shampoo and conditioner. And I have a leave-in conditioner already that I showed you that I got from Amazon. But I wanted to see, I'm going, I am gonna cut my hair this week and then dye it. So I wanted to get something that has a little extra conditioner because once I dye it, it's kind of harsh on your hair. So I got that. And that is that guys that I'm telling you, my hauls have been really small. I have a walk around, so I will also be adding that to the clip. It's just the beauty section, just to show you the beauty section. I think I got a couple of pictures. Also in the food section, there was a handwritten sign saying that they are sorry, but because of the global shortage of wheat, there will be no pasta. So there was no pasta in the store at all nothing no elbow macaroni nothing like that no spaghetti so and usually i do pick up on uh, for you know just in case of emergencies i'll pick up that two pounds of pasta that they have for a dollar 25 not a bad price um 
but they didn't have that. So I'm going to check the other stores and see if I see any more signs saying that there's a global shortage. I'll show you the sign right here. You'll see the sign and you can read it for yourself. Let me know if your stores have shortages of pasta. Let me know down below. Um, I did pick up a little box of the uh, ready um, mashed potatoes. I got a box of them and I'm putting them in my emergency. I'm going to put them in my food storage bin that I have. I have a bin and it's just in case like one week something happens and you know you can't get to the store or a snowstorm comes. You can't get to the store. I have, I have to show you my emergency box of what I have in there so you guys can see. I, that will be a video I'll do and I can show you an emergency box that you can prepare from the Dollar Tree also. All right, guys, I will see you in my next video. Like I say, somehow, some way, I'll have an amazing day. You make your day amazing and together, friends, we'll have an amazing day. I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys. Enjoy the pictures.